to Super Mario Odyssey! Philip's Game Review Special. Today we will be reviewing all the different kinds of jumps you can do. And Cappy throws. Now, let's get right into it. Now, Action Guide tells you them. I'm going to go, go over them, look at all of them, and do them. So, there's a long jump here. You hit so now, I do not have the Pro Controller. I will be not using the Pro Controller. So, for long jumping, you will hit um, B or A while pressing the two um, thick top buttons, like that. See? That's how you do a long jump. Ah, and next one we're going to go over is rolling the the top thick buttons like the long jump but you hit y while you're doing it like that and that's the roll and the next action we will be going over is ground pounding okay now you just hit Duck the, the top thick button, but in mid-air only. That's the only way it works. Otherwise, you just do a little crouch like that. Um, And by the way, the top button is like, um, the thick top button on your either controller you can use, it's like um on the back of it, right or left side. Either one is fine, and Let's get to the next one. Basic actions and dive. Now, in midair, why Mario is falling, you hit um the same buttons for um the exact same buttons for roll, but when Mario is in midair. Same thing. Um, the Z, L, or Z are while hitting Y at the same time. It's the same thing. And that's how you do the dive. See the next one we're gonna do. Okay. G oh, ground pound jump. Not a ground pound, it's a ground pound jump. Do the ground pound. But if you jump too late, it turns into a normal jump. Ground pound and then jump immediately gives you a higher jump. Let's see, let's see. This Mario's arm is right above Captain Toad, but if I ground pound, his body is right above Captain Toad. Now that's the big difference for that. Now, what shall be our next one? Oh, um, why or shake? Oh, this is, um, let's see, are there any captures in this kingdom? Uh, um, let me find, huh? Hmm, huh, where might the capture be? Um, um, I guess this is fine. Rockets are capture, right? Now, you, this one was just showing you why to throw your cap, Y or X, either one, and then to release the capture, Z, L, or Z, R, like that. Let's see the next one. Hmm, basic actions. I just wanna, ah, upward throw. This one, you shake your control upward. Shake your, put your control flat, and then Shake it upward, or not like that. Shake it upward. I'm kind of bad at this one. Ah, you have it flat down. Shake it upward. Um, stopping at when it's in its normal position. 
And that's how you do that one. Um, these next few are gonna be about Cappy. There's a little symbol about it. Now, I just want, ah, downward throw. Heard your controller, the, the way you always play with it. And then you you could do this um, either way. You just shake, put your controller flat, and then stop when it's the other side way flat. Either, you can start either way. It's, it's way easier when you jump and you do it. So, next. Next one. Hmm. This is, yeah, the next three are, ah, here we go. Um, I think this is called spinning cappy. Just um, put your controller norm, um, facing the same way that your face is looking at it, and then put it to the side, and then just shake upwards, and that's how you do that one. Ah, hmm. Maybe you just shake, yeah, you just shake your controller all around. That's all you gotta do. Turn your controller all around. Circle it, circle it. You just gotta circle it all around. Okay. Copy, throw, and hold. Copy, throw, and hold is kind of easy in my opinion. Um, hold on, I mean like, um, huh. It would be easier if there are boxes around here or something. Um, I guess no boxes is fine. Um, to do this one, all you got to do is um, throw Cappy and hold that Y or X button down. If you just tap it, it doesn't do it for as long. Hold it, it does it for a really long time. Next action. Basic actions, okay. Okay, this one's kinda cool. This one includes holding down Cappy. Hold down Cappy and run into him, you do a kind of a cool jump. It's not a normal one at all. You could, you, you do that. This one, his hand is about um almost up to that tree and and now his feet are higher. That's the big difference. You can do this um, when when it's in air. You could put it like that. You could jump towards it. You don't usually get the jump towards. You could do that and then dive. Hold on. You could do that and um, if you throw Cappy with um, X, um, use the Y button to dive. If you, it's kind of hard for me. Ah, there we go. That's how you do it. There it is. And the next action we will go over. Ah, homing cap throw. Now, enemy, 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 enemy. Um, I need any, ah, let me just get this checkpoint while I'm here. Okay. Now, it, you throw your cap and shake it. It goes to the um, it, it goes to the um nearest target it can find. Either you go down or up, left or right, or possibly um down. Did I say that twice? Basic actions. Oh. That, that's all for Cappy. Backwards somersault. Hold down um, ZL or ZR, either one is fine, and then just hit B or A. And that's the backwards somersault. Let's see the difference here. Here's somersault, about his hat is right under that tree, and this one, uh, it's not much of a difference. Mm. It's a difference, but not much of it. 
now. Let's see the next one. Miss actions. Hmm. Ah, here we go. Side somersault. This one, you just run and um turn your controller the um opposite direction you're going and hit the jump button like yeah. that. That's a sideways somersault. It doesn't always work. You have to wait for him to do that little um fire thing that makes him stop or it won't work. And the next one is, hmm, what's the next action? Ah, triple jump. Now this one, all you gotta do is jump three times repeatedly and um but each jump is bigger than the other one is bigger than the last but the thing is um you jump walk and jump it doesn't do that um three what road three three um higher jumps in a row so you so you can't run at all unless it'll um take it away that that jump from you Wall jump. This one's kind of cool. I use wall jumps all the time to get to very high places. This one, all you're doing is holding onto a wall um, like that and then hit the jump button. It puts you sideways and then that's a, um, and that is a wall jump. Next, action. Hmm, what might this one be? Throwing a seed. Um, throwing a seed, that's, okay. I know there is a seed somewhere around here. I just, am not sure where it is. Hold on. Um, seed, seed. Seed, um, to the map. Here, okay. I gotta go here to look to that, um, where there's a seed, seed, where's the seed? Ah, here it is! The trick for the seed is run into it while holding Y without having Cap, you throw at it, and then to release it, hit Y, just tap it. That's the secrets for seeds. Big seed? Or a little seed, same thing, except um, the little seed you can wall jump with, big seed you can't. Swim, um, uh, is there any water? Hmm, oh yeah, um, next to the castle. Let me go over there. Um, This place has everything. Peach's castle has like everything. The trick for swimming is, um, if you're not in guide mode for Mario Odyssey, you're gonna have a timer or a limit for how long you can breathe and then you start to get hit repeatedly. Um, this one, you just keep tapping the jump button and then you Mario goes up. Um, if you wanna go um, in a straight line faster, hit the jump button um, w with pressing ZL or um, or Z R like that, but you have to do them at the same exact time. I, I had to get out because I was about to lose a life. But if you're on top of the water, you don't have to hit the jump button to um, get over. You, it, it just jumps for you. Next, power thingy action, basic actions. Spin. Spin isn't so bad. Now this one, you just run in a circle with Mario, and then you jump, throw Cappy, it's a spin thing automatically. And there you go. That's actually um the Jaxi thing with the Jaxi, I'll showcase that later, cause I'm not in Sand Kingdom right now. Now you need Sand Kingdom. Dash, okay. Let me find a 2D area. 
I know there's one in this kingdom. I just, is it? I think it's next to the castle. You you can see the view of it from the castle. Hey, a checkpoint. Okay, if you skip this video, you might see some checkpoints already caught from this video here. So just know that if you are watching this video now. Ah, 2D area. Dashing in a 2D area, hold Y and just, hold on. I'm not gonna do anything in this 2D area, but, okay. Hold dash, ah, what? Yeah, you just hold Y and then you dash. Let's get back to the other area. Oh wait, hold on. No one, hold on. Um. Hey, they didn't go over duck. Weird. They did not go over duck. They only went in over enter pipe and motor scooter. I will show you duck without the action guide because they the action guide didn't tell you. Just hold down ZL or ZR and then you crouch. That's the crouch thing. And you can walk like it, but it's way slower. Hit Y, and then it's even faster. And then hit jump, even faster. Now, I'm gonna go back to that warp place. Enter pipe is kind of easy in a 3D place. Ah, oh no, mm, there's a 2D place right here. Now, enter warp pipe in a 3D area, just run into the pipe. 2D area, right into the pipe too. But if it's if the pipe is facing upwards, you will duck. Same buttons. Or you could just hit the down, use the down arrow thing. That would also be fine. And that will be it for today's video. I think. Mm, wait. No, I'm forgetting one. Which am, am I forgetting? Hmm, let me think, let me think. I think I'm forgetting one. Oh, the tricks combined onto the castle. Now, this one is kind of actually really tricky. Ground pound? Um, yeah, I don't, I'm not even sure I can do this. Um, this one is really hard. Hmm, I'm gonna need to get Yoshi. Hold on guys, Yoshi is at the top of the castle. Hold on, it's, it's not, um, let me just, let me just do it. This is a way to get on top of the castle. Let me just act, let me just, uh-huh. Hmm, let me just get on top of the castle. It's sometimes really hard. It's not always this hard, but you might have difficulties with it like I am. Huh, why? Hmm, I'm gonna just go to the normal way and get Yoshi. To get Yo to um get on top of it from here, you need Yoshi. That's the trick. You're gonna need Yoshi. It might sound like cheating, but that's the only way you're gonna make it happen. I think I never got up there without Yoshi. But I don't think it's possible. That's the only thing I gotta say. I don't think it's possible without Yoshi, even from the other, I know I've done the other part from the front before, but the back, I don't think it's possible. I've never done it from the back before. Why is this so hard? Ah, there we go. Hat, come back. Now, I wasn't, I didn't think I would have to showcase Yoshi yet, but I'll do it for the trick. Now, Yoshi cannot touch water or he will lose and you'll have to get him back. Jump, do that thing, stick onto the wall, dive. Oh, what? Oh, that should have worked. I know that's a way to do it. Hmm. 
I'll try one more time and then if I can't do it, I'll just end the video. I don't I will show you other tricks in the future though. Hmm. I'm going to try this one one what? I just fell off. I'll show you other tricks actually in this video. Um, sorry if I have to go to other kingdoms. It might be a little hard, but um, that's what. There we go. That's how you do it from the front. I just want to show you guys how to do the Peach's Castle from the back. It's a little difficult, more difficult than other ones, but. Hit. Hit. Hmm. Ah, there we go. That's how you make it happen. What the? Is there a cat peach up in this place? I think I saw cat peach. Da 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 da. Tootie cat peach. Right there. Tootie cat peach gives you a heart. Um, Tootie Mario cat Mario gives you. A couple coins. Now, I will go to other kingdoms. In this video, actually. Now, sorry if this will take a little, um, but my, I'm gonna showcase my favorite tricks. One of them takes place in Cap Kingdom. Now let me set sail. I'm glad you can skip the cutscenes of setting sailing. That's a pretty good thing. Cap Kingdom, let's set sail. One of my favorites takes place in Cap Kingdom on Top Hat Tower. No more brutals up there, luckily, because I already beat it in the first episode of Mario Odyssey. And my first episode in my life, actually. I'll get those moon rocks in uh, other episodes. I don't want to actually make any progress. I'm just here to show tricks. You might see me skip um, moons or public coins if, they, if they're right in the open. I just have to move to it because I don't want to make any progress. You guys might get confused or... I'll just get checkpoints for the future. That'll be kind of... That won't be so bad. Let's get up here. Huh. What? I don't think there are flying Goombas here before. Don't I have a checkpoint? Yeah, I have a checkpoint up to Top Hat Tower, just to make it a little faster. Cause going through the frog thing, that takes a that takes a pretty long time. Now, you might see some failures of mine. I, um, ha I've done it before, it just takes a lot of practice. I, it only will take me about two tiles. If I'm lucky, one. Now, where is the hat? Hold on. Now, first, over there. That hat tower. Long jump, wait for it. And that's one of my favorite tricks. I have had some misses before in, in before when I wasn't recording, but that that is the Cap Kingdoms. I th I have a favorite trick jump for every kingdom. I already showcased Mushroom Kingdom. That was a castle one, front and back side. You will need Yoshi for the back side. I haven't done it without him yet. Not in my life, not even when I haven't recorded. Cascade Kingdom. Now, this trick jump might seem fairly easy though. It's not actually a trick jump, you're just gonna have to catch onto the edge or something. It's a really hard jump to do. You're gonna have to do it. Now, okay. Yeah, I'm not getting these moon rocks. That's, that just makes other moons. I'll do that in the future episodes when I come back to these kingdoms to get more moons. Hold on. Now, my favorite trick jump is, okay, hold on, this might take a little long. Um, I used to know this trick. 
I know this. Ah, there we go. There it is. My favorite trip jump in Cascade. This might um strike to you all a hard trip jump. It might be hard for a lot of people, but if you're a master, you can do it. And I am a master, my friends. Of this game, nothing that I, no trick jumps that I can't do, other than that castle without Yoshi. Hit. And that's my favorite trick jump. I jumped from all the way over down there up to here. Let's see this. I stunned my feet. That's That means it's a very high jump. Now, Sand Kingdoms is actually a cycle of jumps. That, so I'm gonna have to do a long jump to get to one place, a long jump to, to get to the others, and then um, finally the big trick jump. I have a checkpoint right before all the tricks start, so that's a good thing. Most of you won't be able to be doing this, but um, it just takes practice. You've just got to practice, start combining all of the tricks, and then you'll be a master at tricks, like I am. And even when you're a master like me, you don't always get your trick the first time, you know. It takes time, it takes practice. Now, I actually have two favorite trick jumps in this entire area. Um, this this um, is right next to the mall, this checkpoint. Now this one is glide on. You keep shaking while you fly him. Okay, okay. And then you get out of him right there. Hold on. I messed that up, didn't I? This trick jump is actually pretty hard. It's not a trick jump, it's more of a timing for when you get out of glide on situation. I I got it like my fifth time actually. I was trying to hide a balloon in Luigi's balloon world. For those of you that don't know what that is, when you beat the game, um, there's some DLC about Luigi um, where people hide balloons and um, find balloons, you get coins for it. You spend coins for um, finding someone's balloon, you get more coins for um, finding it, but you try to do it repeatedly. You could quit and um, do a b different balloon. You could hide a balloon for other people. It, there's a lot of cool stuff. I'll, I'll make a video of that DLC. Oh! Yeah, this trick jump is pretty hard. Um, hmm. I'm gonna slow down. I'm going to do it though. You all will see. You can always fast forward the video if you don't wanna um, see me um, miss the trunk jump repeatedly. You can just fast forward to the time I do get it. Um, come on, come on. Oh, oi, oh. Hmm. I'm going to get it this time. I can feel it. I'm going to do it. Like I said, these kind of trick jumps, these take a lot of practice. A lot and lot of practice. Lots of that. That's for sure. Ah, finally, I did it. And that's my favorite trick jump. Um, You don't want to do those tricks, you just kind of an average or you can't do that much jumps. You can always just take the slingshot. Takes you to the same exact place. Now, my second favorite um, cool jump in this kingdom will be, same checkpoint actually. I love that they're all in the, um, they're all right next to a checkpoint flag. I love that. Now, this, I might be having a failure the first couple of times, but nobody's perfect. Nobody's perfect. I sometimes do a backwards flip on accident when I try to long jump, but that's fine. Okay, yeah, this is a lot of jumps you're seeing. 
these are just a lot of cool jumps to get to one eye area one area if you're not patient now next world was what was next world oh yeah lake kingdom lake kingdom um might be a little hard to figure out your favorite jump but i figured out mine it's a pretty um i don't know it's a pretty uh, bad one. It, there's not many options for favorite jumps in Lake Kingdom. It's it's pretty much all flat with water. So, but I found mine, and it was kind of hard to do, but I did it. It's easy. It's a lot easier. Um, if you miss it, you just hit the stairs. If you have beaten the um, world, or at least beaten the boss of it. Okay. I did try this before in the episode of Lake Kingdom. I actually, I think I had a failure of it actually. But this time, I'm going to get it right. I had a failure of it again. Think that again. I did have a failure of it the other time. But won't have it now. And that's my favorite. There's not many options you can do for these trick jumps though. Hmm. Next kingdom. That was a, don't give up when you're trying this though. There's not many options for it, but don't give up trying to get it and looking for it. Never give up. Woody kingdom. Woody kingdom is actually a easy jump. Kind of. You start from a high place, you get to a low place. It's kind of far, but it takes a lot of practice for this one. But honestly, all I had to do is long jump. I showed that I actually showcased this in the video. I showcased this kingdom. Let me get. Is it? I think it's here. It's here. I am going to have to go through a 2D section. Very short. Takes about one minute. Very short. Hit, hit, hey, yes! Always got it. To the area, to the area, to the area. Okay. Let's get over here. And let's go through this. I showcase this in my, I showcase this to the area and the trick jump in my other episode when I showcased Woody Kingdom, just to get the bosses, get all the moons, and head on to the next kingdom. There is a lot of kingdoms. I haven't unlocked two. Also, I will be showing those, quote, my favorite, uh, what? How would I do that? I will be showing my favorite cold tricks of those kingdoms in the future when I actually unlock the kingdoms. I haven't done it yet. It's gonna take a long time. I'm gonna have to beat every other, um, I'm just gonna beat every other world um, wall to get the other two. One of them is faster than the other. In my opinion, harder than the other. Now, I'm not gonna try to fall off this edge. Not trying to do anything else either. If you long jump from here, you side jump there, you got here. Kinda hard to do, but never give up. Okay, next kingdom. I'm so glad you can actually warp to the Odyssey. That's a cool feature. We unlocked that in Cascade when I actually found the Odyssey. Okay, next kingdom is what? I forgot. Ah, Cloud Kingdom. Oh, Cloud Kingdom? There is no fancy jump for this one. We're gonna go ahead and move on to Lost Kingdom. Cloud Kingdom is where we fought Bowser for the first time, episode six. Do you all remember that? We fought Bowser, no cool tricks, just an arena that is flat. Nothing to do there, moving on and skipping that area, because there's nothing you can do there. Nothing. 
nothing. Just a battle arena that's flat from where we fought Bowser for the first time, but shot us fully, Lost Kingdom. Lost Kingdom takes place in a higher place with glide on. A lot of these things are having glide on. Lots and lots of them. Okay, capture you. Okay. Hit. You, you're gonna have to let go right there and continue flying, jump off, and that's my favorite trick, jump. If you, um, if you don't time the um, getting out of glide on correctly, you will lose glide on and fall into poison. Metro, Metro. I did not showcase this one. I didn't even get to the tower of it. But sadly enough, to do this, I will have to get gain one moon, or it'll be in my. Or wait, will I? No, I can skip the moon part. Actually, I thought I'll. No, I was thinking of a different one that was not my favorite. You don't have to get the moon. Sorry about that, but let's see, let's see. Up here, New Donk City Hall. Tower, not hall, it's tower. New Donk City. It used to be owned to the ferocious and stole Pauline, Donkey Kong. That's, um, that's a pretty cool um, game and, well, a lot of games really. Okay. And that one is pretty easy to do if you know how to um, actually drive in the air with the motorcycle. That one's pretty easy. And moving on to the next kingdom is Seaside. Seaside Kingdom. It was pretty hard for me to choose this one to be honest. Pretty, pretty hard. Honestly, I couldn't do it. I tried to do it repeatedly. It didn't work out, so I just stuck with the one where I landed. I might get it in this video. It'll be a lot of attempts of trying and finally doing it. I hope I do it in this video. If not, that's okay. Because if you don't get it, you still land in a pretty high area that you cannot get without glide on. It's not possible unless you go to the higher place where I was trying to get and, and failed and you just jump down. That's a pretty good way to get it. Okay, glide on, shake, 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 shake. Yes, yeah, yeah. oh, oh no! That's what happened to me in my other trials of this. I'll make it soon enough. I know it. One more try. This shouldn't be too hard for me. The one problem with this is the platform is very um, short and, well, skinny, actually. It's, it's really hard to get it. You have to get out of him at the right time. You have to be gliding at the right position. Yeah, that's not what I was doing. I made it! Yeah, I made it! Now, if you just do this carefully, you do that. Hold on. Um, there would be a moon there if you hit the moon rock that we will showcase in other episodes when I go back to them to get all the moons. Moon rock is basically this rock that spits out more moons everywhere. We are getting close to the end here. Snow, 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 snow. Um, Snow Kingdom? That was actually a hard choice to do. There's a lot of high areas, but not very good places to get to. That's the problem. But, I decided to do this. I tried one that I saw from some other master. I, I don't know how that guy did it. I could not do it. It's from here to up there, that seeker. I did not know how in the world he did that jump. I tried a lot of times, I couldn't do it, so I chose a different 
jump. Hold on, let me find it. Here to up there. That's actually a pretty hard one. Okay. I actually never even got to get this one. I had to get up on this thing with no misses. I could never do that. That would be my favorite jump if I could do it. That's, honestly, other than that one that uh, that other master did, I have no idea what other jumps there are. I don't know how that other master got that other jump. It seemed really impossible to me. It, it just seemed impossible. In possible. It's possible, but it's in that possible. It's stuck in there without getting it out. You can't do it. It's really hard jump. It's a really hard jump. Now let's see. Aha! Hit, hit, hit. Yep. Okay. Now where is this one? Ah, I remember. I will go to the city place. And then we shall be very close to it. Everyone's here. Everyone win. No. Hey. Now, this one we have to kind of get up there. Now, this one we will start all the way up here. Long. You could jump or long jump. I like um long jumping. Long jump. Do that. And voila! That's my favorite jump in the Lungeon Kingdom. A lot of these worlds are very hard to choose them. They don't have many high places. Some of them have high places, but not a lot of them do. Set sail to another kingdom. Ruined? Ah, uh, ruined is kind of like Cloud Kingdom, arena of a dragon boss fight with a flat surface. I honestly don't have any here. I don't even know why I said it sail. Now, you will see that there is a platform here. Or actually, I have a favorite one. This is the actually the only trick jump that I know of in this kingdom. Ah. I, I did miss it a lot of times. This is a, this is, I don't know what other choices there are of trick jumps in this kingdom. I don't even think there are any, to be honest. I don't think there are. That's the only, there's that one and that, well, there would be that one if I could do it. I got it a lot of times, I was just, I don't know, man. Just the thought of not having any trick jumps just gets it kind of like, um, like kind of boring to do these ones. These are, these aren't really fun ones. Now, as you will see in the map, all here is that little platform here and battle arena of a dragon that is totally flat. So I I can't think of any other trick jumps. But let's sing a Bowser's Kingdom. <laughs> this one was kind of hard for me to choose because there are a lot of good trick jumps here. Lots and lots and lots. But my favorite one was diving into a side pool. Let's see. Um, secret cavern. Court entrance. Outer. Wall. It's outer wall. I think I have to warp to outer wall, and then I should be there. I think. Yeah, there are bullets here. This is the area. 
is not the area at all. This is not the area at all. One. Um. One checkpoint forward, and then I'll be there. I think this one is actually true. Okay, long jump. Sideways that one. Keep long jumping and finally throw your cap. You're in the water. My final, um, is it next Moon Kingdom? Moon Kingdom is the last one. Other, we already showcased Mushroom Kingdom. That's the one that after that, then there's no more. But let's say go. Moon Kingdom. That's the last one we will be showcasing for today's video. This is longer than I thought. I wasn't actually planning on making these, um, making the favorite tricks of this, but here we are doing it. I didn't plan on doing it though, but we are. Okay, Cappy, I know, I know, Cappy. You told me that for almost every kingdom. Actually, it is every kingdom. Repeatedly. Haha. -ha. The only thing I'm progressing progressing with the story in this video is checkpoints for the future. It's the only thing. And I'm not even getting that one moon sword right there. Not happening. I'm gonna try to get up here. Yes! Oh, what? Ha! Hey, yes! Yes, yes, come on, come on. Hmm. Hit. Hit. Ah, I got it. That one's a pretty hard, tough one to do. Then there's one last one. Jump up here. Do that. Barely um get you could you barely get over here and then finally um just jump and then you get there. Finally the the finish finale is hold on what? It's not running it? Oh no, it was the other one. The finish finale is almost here. This is actually a lot of jumps um, created into one. All of these jumps are pretty cool in my opinion. That's what my opinion is. Leave in the comments below if for what your favorite jump of all of these ones is. Each, um, each kingdom. Which one is it? Then the fi final finale is right under this bell. Da -da 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 -da. Long jump, there is normal gravity in this place. And then you land right here. That will be it for today's video. Let me just get to the Odyssey and go back to Mushroom Kingdom. <laughs> for the next video, we will showcase mu Mushroom Kingdom just to get some of the moons, just complete it for, but after that, we will do Cat Kingdom and finish, complete it. Let's just get here and I will say our end of video. Video, 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 video. Video! Aha! Let's see it all. Let's go. That will be it for today's video again. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos in the future. I will see you guys next time for more 